Okay then. Welcome. Why did I press that start button so so aggressively? Should have seen it. I damn near would be would damn be a bad word on YouTube. You know what? Neither here nor there. But six guys role play being gay. And there's one odd man out who is actually gay. So I'm I guess I I mean I'm not watching the video, but playback did a video on it, so I find I I like playback it was I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. When did everyone realize they were gay? Um, probably like end of high school after my first relationship. Uh, it was a girl, and it was just not for me. Um, I think for me, it was in middle school. It was Queens East Coast like before puberty, so I was just East Coast player in New York. Urban B ball. Kind of figuring things out for myself. Who you guys and think also it is? other kids were understanding too. So that I thought this was a girl. Look, look, not even at me, but like like that. Didn't you think this was a girl too? Like like I didn't see nothing else. I thought this was a girl. Maybe it is. Maybe that's what they want to go about. But you know what? Forget about it. Oh. So I know exactly when it was. <laughs> I grew up in a very religious home. And I too was in relationships with with girls. So um, what I did was I, I, hid, Lucifer. I hid myself for a long time. Mm -hmm. So it's I'm trying not to tear up. Um, <clears throat> you got glasses on. We can't see your eyes. What religious household would name their son Lucifer? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> he just adopted the name. Though. He had to. Him. They named me Jesus. I wasn't feeling that. <laughs> It wasn't feeling I had to go straight to Lucifer, man. I had to go straight to Lucifer. This is a very dangerous video to upload by Julie, yeah. man. Because one of these people are going to try to appropriate being gay for an entire video and do some of the most stereotypical gay stuff imaginable. Like what? I don't know. We're going to figure out. Me, personally, I'm not that You don't know? Of, I don't. I don't. I'm not okay. that type of a guy. Uh, okay. Just I sure. would never do that myself. But we're, we're here. We're going to figure out what it looks like to act gay. Because one of these men are acting gay. Out to my little brother. I actually knew when I was eight. Um, my grandma took me to see Mamma Mia. And if you've seen the movie, you know <laughs> the beach scene. You know exactly what I'm talking about. And I knew something was just a little bit off about me when I realized that I was more attracted to Skye than I was Sophie. I'm like, something about him. You know, mine, honestly, is right after Twilight came out. <laughs> Robert Pattinson, I don't know. So Yo, good. Who's oh, team? So who's good. team? So good. Of course. Oh, wait. I read that wrong. So there's one person that's straight and five that are gay. Yeah, I read that wrong. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about what Agent said, and I was like, what does he mean like one person is going to pretend to be gay? But now I got it. Of course, um, Pattinson for sure. Um, Edward. I knew in middle school, like, there was something up with me. I was like, I like. I don't like that answer. I didn't like that answer. I like that answer, bro. No, no, of course, of course, of yeah. course. Which team are you, nigga? Go yeah, well, on. come on, bro. You know what that question was. What team are you, bro? I, I got my eyes on him. I got my eyes on him too, yeah. bro. Man, that's 100%. But I called myself bisexual, and then freshman year in high school, I was just like, I'm gay. Like, the way I feel about women is not nothing like the way I feel about men. I think that's actually a really good answer. I already revealed mine. I think that's a really good answer. Really? <laughs> yeah, you're... Uh, no, but... Are you great these would, answers? From what I would assume to be okay. a really good answer, <laughs> I think that's a really good answer. Okay. Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's a lot or, of sexually oh, curious men around the world. I don't think they immediately just go, bam, I'm gay. I'm pretty sure there's a transitional phase. I'm happy he talked about it. It opens up our palette to new things that we can discuss now. But what is everyone's favorite celebrity crush? Mine is also a vampire. It's Paul Wesley from okay. Vampire Diaries. He okay. was like my gay awakening, yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. Okay, well, mine. I did watch Vampire Diaries for a little bit, but Originals is my shit. I know this is completely out of topic. Was Robert Pattinson? So kind of. Yeah, yeah, we got Ross Lynch. Something about that man is just. Hey, yeah, my guy. Just. Ah, uh, I just love Ross Lynch. Yeah. <laughs> Prince and Idris Elba. Mine was mine right now is <laughs> Pedro Pascal. You're on the Pedro Pascal He's train? So yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I am. I'm your daddy. Matt Bomber. Uh -huh. uh, from White Collar. Love like the snake yeah. eyes are so sad. Is that why do I feel like this is so stereotypical? What do you mean? Like this is like a bunch of black people asking so, hey yo man, what favorite Kool-Aid you like? <laughs> why do they have to have celebrity crushes? Why, why is that a, as grown men. Yeah, as grown men, why do they have to have celebrity crushes? It's do you have question. a celebrity crush? Mm. Exactly. I I just feel like this is so stereotypical. Because if somebody asks me what's my favorite Kool-Aid, I'll be like, that's a weird question for you to ask. <laughs> 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 right, that's it. What do you guys hate about straight men? 
They're what instantly just, like, take criticism oh or take God. no as yes. an answer. Yeah. Like, what is up with that? Like, I understand patriarch and all that, but still. I know, like, consent. Literally. Um, their inability to have any sort of fashion. It's just <laughs> t-shirts. <laughs> just yeah. about to and say jeans. that. I'm not taking this fucking I'm slander. About, he's talking about you, though. No, but I'm... He's talking in about the general you, though. sense, I'm not about to sit here and lie to, like, slander me. Like, I'm just not going to do that right He's now. right about the fashion thing. No, we know plenty of fashionable straight men. But you, though. Bruce is definitely fashionable. Okay, you can't bring BDG that. is definitely fashionable. Okay. Kai, you know, I'll say Kai. Kai is it, Dude. Why? Is that not fashionable? No, I mean, yeah, but back to back. John is definitely fashionable. Okay. Oh, the straight niggas. Yeah. So I'm not going to allow them to do this. That nigga's no. wearing a red striped shirt. <laughs> blue Wrangler jeans. That is true. Because I'm not even into fashion. That nigga fashion is off the fucking mark, nigga. So, uh, somebody, one of y'all niggas need to sit down with him and get him correct and get him on point, bro. T-shirts, jeans, or like just basketball shorts. You know, you know, you see those men who clearly use like the three-in-one shampoos and I'm just like, oh my gosh. How? They brush their teeth with it. Yeah. Like, like, I swear. Oh my god, this one guy had a 10-in-1. I did in not even want to way. ask what it meant. Lucifer, I just wanted to ask you, Um, so you said at 15 is when you knew, right? That, that you were gay? Yes, that's when I came to terms with it for myself. And then you said, at co like, during COVID was when you told your brother? Yes. So that whole time he didn't know? No. Really? How, how did that feel for you? I thought, I, I think he tried to catch him lacking. You said at 15, right? Because <sighs> were you guys close? I know that side. Come on. I've been, I've been watching YouTube apologies since Come 2015, on. nigga. No. That's the YouTube fake Come apology on. side of death. This is the... Let me get my tears together. Okay, okay, let me get my tears together. Oh man, they're not working. <laughs> yeah, I'm onto this nigga now. We were, but I moved from Memphis when I was 18. Okay. We've been long distance for all that time. I see. He really didn't make a big deal out of it. Just told me that he loved me no matter what. I see. Well, I can, can I ask why did you not come out to him earlier if you guys felt so comfortable together with that? Or yes. supportive? Yes, so for me, when I was growing up, the thing that mattered most was getting married and having a family. I had to keep that facade a long time. I was actually practicing to be a minister in 2012, oh, wow. right when uh, President Obama uh, declared gay marriage uh, legalized nationwide. And when I was in... Is she texting someone behind your back? A single Spokio search can help you find out who she's messaging. Yeah, I don't care that much. Why does she... I want to hear. Oh my god! Oh, oh, god. oh, oh that god. bullshit! Thank god! Now he might be telling the truth. If he is, I know, but that's a lot at, of. He yeah, sucks at telling yeah, the he truth. does. He's bad. Like, I was being a minister back in um. Uh, what was it? 20, the, the, the Obama uh, administration. Obama, when Obama when first when they were, um, that, that was when Young Jeezy dropped "My President Is Black." Was that? That's when that was. Yeah, yeah right okay. then. Yeah. And I think. I think. I think that was when I bought my first red bottoms. But please forgive me. And then I was practicing in the ministry, and then that's when Obama. He allowed mm -hmm. gay people shooting airstrikes or no? Yeah, no. I can't remember. Oh, oh! <laughs> that's, that's it? The bell rang? Back. Okay. okay. Wow. Good luck, guys. It, it kind of hurted a little bit. Kind of hurted. Why do you think they were suspicious of you? The t shirt um, and jeans. Mainly because I'm wearing just jeans and a t shirt, but I look stylish and I look amazing. So. You got to remember you mentioned that, like, gay marriage was being legalized in 2012, but it was 2015, right? 2013. Yeah, that's 2013? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, like. Damn, nigga tried to correct him. <laughs> look at him. He's like. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, this nigga's like. You better know that one. <laughs> no way you. Thought you threw a 2015, you're wrong, buddy. Yeah, because it was, I, I remember it precisely. I was, I was on the phone with my pastor, actually, when that announcement was made. He was running in 2012, so yeah, he right. would have. Right. So 15, 16? I'm bad at math. I'm terrible. Well, it, it, it took, it took a while. How the fuck have none of y'all gay niggas know? What's going at on? At this bro? point, the nigga that knows might not be gay. Because none <sighs> of the gay niggas know. What if, he, but what if he's actually gay and he keeps throwing out years to throw them off? <laughs> Because that's what I would do. 16? 15? Also, also, it's like, it should be slightly embarrassing to not know this. I don't think so. I mean, I don't know what year slaves got free, so. I'm black. Okay, but what if the slaves were freed less than 10 years ago? Um, yeah, then, yeah. Sure, but I. I... Yeah, nah, no sure, you would know. It just happened, man. Yeah. Yo, I get that. I get that. <laughs> this nigga should really know, though. 
Because he was practicing to be a pastor, without a doubt, he should be the hundred percent, no, no, no. right? Isn't ministry like where you match people and stuff? Yeah, like? not well, not, you know, not match when you marry. Like. I marry them. You got <laughs> matchmaking. Is really While for it to actually go into legislation, gotcha. so you can say 2012, but if you're technically yes, it, it did take a, okay, a, okay. a few years into that second term before it was actually registered. What are some? He knew though. He was right. Oh, he was right. Okay, okay. So he knew. Okay, good for him. Things you look for in a guy. Oh, creativity, um, style, and confidence. The number one will be hygiene. Yeah. Mm. I bathe at least twice a day, if you know, if not more. In a drought. So, <sighs> not <in> a <laughs> baby, please look. Yeah. You know, I gotta freshen up. So I expect yeah, yeah, that yeah. from someone else. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I get that. I get that. Yeah. Yeah, my boyfriend, every time I, or my ex-boyfriend. Oh, no. Yeah, every time I'd come in. Like, He's trying too hard, bro. Yeah. He's trying too hard. My boyfriend, my I mean, my ex, man, I mean, my ex, my, my ex lover man. Like, nigga, come on, bro. He's trying too 100%. hard. 100%. He's trying too hard. Like, the room is just super messy. And, like, I'm really big on bathroom cleanliness. Mm. Mm. Yes. It's the last place you are at night and the first place you are in the exactly. morning. And most traditional men are just um, dirty in the bathrooms. Right. Um, for me, definitely funny. And, I mean, obviously, you have to look good. Like, that's, that's... <laughs> Yeah, that's not started though. <laughs> Mine is basically somebody that could just hang and vibe with me. I'm a very active person, whether that be like I'm going out hiking, I go out mm. working out. Height doesn't really matter. I mean, haven't found anybody as tall as me <laughs> yeah. yet. How um, tall are you? 6'6". Six, six. Okay. How tall are you? 6'2", uh, but I have these on right now, so a little bit taller. I love those, by the way. Oh, thanks. Yeah, they're they're brand cool. new. They're Doc Martens. Me too, me too. Um, a little more <laughs> on the submissive side. We're out. Um, I hate the bottom. Oh, um, I'm, I'm, just, I'm, all right. I'm just being I'm just being honest, I guess, because I was in such a controlled environment for so mm. many years. I just have a way of controlling that space. Okay. Mm. Can we? Yeah, he's dominant. I like that. I like that for him. Okay, bet. I like that for him. Now, that's good. That's good. He's gay. He's good. We don't. I'm, I'm not falling for these trickery. Run down and say <laughs> what we are like you already answered. Yes. We'll say bottom. Top. Or verse. Top verse. I, I say I'm a, I'm a verse top. Yeah. Verse bottom. He's definitely a bottom. Ricky is a bottom for sure. Did you see what this man is wearing? Yeah, the midriff and all. Yeah, just takes the right person. Nah. Even they onto this nigga. That nigga is not gay, bro. Why? Because Verse bot. Come on, like. Is it the way he dresses? That's what they said, too. Not just me. Don't, don't That's what they said, too. Not they just also said that. Not I'm said. just saying. They said, don't, I just, I just don't try to cancel me, nigga. This is a, this is a, this is a they also said that. video, bro. They're trying to throw you off. This is the perfect so you think, what, So you think they asked this nigga, what are you, a verse bottom top? What are you? What are, I don't know. Verse said, just sound like you know what you're talking about. I didn't even know verse was. What is that? I know. And they just use that same terminology that they heard from somebody else. So I just, like. See, so okay, he's he's the first one who said first. He's he's valid then. He's valid. He's good. So these two then followed up with all the. Or verse. they just have lots of gay friends too. That could be it. That's some shit you would know if you had lots of gay friends. I don't know how I don't I don't know how my friends like to get fucked though. So I don't know. What? Why would you ask? Why would you know how would your gay friends like to get fucked? It's not that, bro. It's just that's just sexual conversations you be having. You have sexual. You don't have sexual conversations with me. Yeah, obviously not. Okay, so that's my point. <laughs> but the point I'm trying to make is you have sexual conversations with Duke. Like if you ask me what type, how did Duke I, like? To like get if fucked? you ask me, whoa, oh my god. Whoa. If you ask me what type I like, then I would answer it. So oh no, 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 the type, no, 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 the type part. But <clears throat> how do you like to get fucked, or how do you like to fuck? That's that, a preference. So that's you don't a, ask me that question. That's a question of preference. You ask Duke that question? No, but you ask I know, Kai that question. I know pointless things about you. Cause you tell, like you, you tell, you say things on a podcast and shit, Yeah, but bro. we're best friends. <laughs> <laughs> that's so they different. Have gay best friends. I'm just saying, like, but I'm not asking my gay. Cause like, do you ask a, a, a female friend of yours how does she like to get fucked? Okay, you're missing the point. The point is, I know Am things I? about your sexual preferences because you volunteer that information. Such as what? So like, such, <laughs> such as you what? You have above average length dick. Like, the, I shouldn't know you're that. But me. you mentioned it in the you're podcast. You're gassing me. I like that. You mentioned it in the Good podcast. Way, man. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, thanks, man. Good way. You're, you're right. You're right. Both. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> Bro. Yeah, you're right, dog. <laughs> for me yeah i agree i think it's very dependent but honestly like the verse comes in more so when it's with like hookups and stuff like that well baby i'm a scorpio so like <laughs> me too oh, oh nice <laughs> so nice mm. you fancy a drink yeah why not Ooh. <laughs> why we got three replays when matt dapped up lucifer that that was i was like okay that was a little 
That was a little straight. That felt very hetero to me. So gay people don't dap up other gay niggas? What the fuck? Ew. Oh, and I'm my other thing. Stuff. If they're open to threesomes, because I, mm. I want to do that. Hey, say it to the camera. <laughs> If you're the out there and you're open to threesomes, this number is available. Right <laughs> I think it's better on paper. I'm not gonna. I just want to break the truth to you. Yeah. Really? Because it's just like it's just another person. It, it just gets a lot. I don't it know. Is. I just feel like I, I right? completely agree. It's more of a novelty for sure. Is it like yes, a lot yes. of just sitting yeah. around? Or... <laughs> <laughs> sitting around. Just yeah, one waiting. Waiting. When's the yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna comment on gay threesomes, but like, if it's like two girls and one guy. I feel like that's not a lot of sitting around. If it's two guys and one girl, that's a train, not called a threesome. And I don't think that's a lot of sitting around. But the other way, I, f I feel like it could be. I don't know. Actually, I feel like it might be the same as two guys and one girl, which wouldn't be. I don't know. Okay, no, no, it's, it's like, happening. No, it's like two at a time. I mean, it's like great. Let's do a round of smash or pass. Dominic Fike. I told you, I told you, bro. Smash, Ooh, smash. Creed 3. Oh mm, my Creed god. Creed 3. The Rock. No. Pass. What? No. Oh, Pass. 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 Yeah. I'm so sorry. Oh they passed on The Rock. That's, that's so surprising to me because you said that you were a top, like you like being in control. Dude, The Rock? Yeah. Okay. I could take him. Okay. He <laughs> said I could take him. What the heck? Yeah, I am. But the I mean, is huge. I've, been, okay, I I've huge. been watching wrestling for a long time too. What the hell? He just out of himself. He about to get packed, as Come he should. On, I'm telling you, bro. Some of those, I'm telling you, bro. Come on, loser. But he can still say like he fumbled, bro. Yeah, but he can still find him attractive. He kind of fucked up though. Yes, he did. Because a rock is definitely. He just said smash to a guy that didn't meet none of the preferences he said yeah. earlier. <laughs> rock is definitely an alpha. Like you're definitely. Damn, Ooh, he, fucked up his he got shit. him out of there. One, one, Literally twenty seconds. He nah, fucked well, up it was the dap too. No, but they said Matt dap ugly. Oh, his his was just simply his answer being a rock. <laughs> oh, they bitches. They jealous. They see. They see. They see. I'm totally star power. They just didn't want to share the money with me. I'm not someone that gets offended easily. But bitch, that offended me. I am offended. <laughs> That this went from gay man so question mark to offended. This makes no damn sense. Look at me. He has pinky nose too. Do I look straight to you? Now you do, actually. Yeah, actually you do. I think they got now, now you look straight. I think, yeah, yeah I told right. you, but I told you, though. Come on. Unless you look straight, question mark. <laughs> Bro. I'm just sitting on the floor now. I don't even know why. All right. One, two, three. Wait, Ray, you can just continue playing? Yes. Uh, I'm not sure. Wow, they really got loose. You confident that the mole is out. Is that correct? Well, that doesn't I make any so. sense. If two niggas just I voted for him, then why is two people's hands That is also up? true, yeah. That makes no sense. They don't even know, like, come on, no strategy. At least say. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like my besties right here. <laughs> so that means the game has ended. It's going to turn red. Watch it be dude in purple. Yeah, okay, they, they're dumb. They just, two people voted for this nigga. And, they, Man. and only one put his hand up. We voted the mole out, and you four will share a cash prize. If the box turns red, be dude in the blue. that means the mole is or the dude in pink. Four, and they win the cash prize themselves. I gotta see your nails. Are ready? I mean, no. I guess they I guess. Yeah. The only reason... He, he, he close now. No, the only reason two people didn't put their hands up is if one of them was the mole. That is true. I think the mole is still in there. Yeah, because the mole just naturally is going to vote for yeah. someone else. Mm -hmm. Let's make an exchange. <laughs> I like the suspense of ab the ab games. An exchange of Ooh. Dumbass. Yep. 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 If you were, if you were, but, one and Lu and but Lucifer voted for matt anyway damn so yeah. it wasn't matt it was one of the other three yeah and i think if i had to guess it's come on i think it's the dude in the red and black bro i don't think it's him i think he's gay. i lied it's pink shirt let's go i said oh, pink yeah, shirt. Sure. Oh, yeah yeah lock that in oh my god i i knew but he wanted to continue I playing was unconfident i said what? i said <laughs> why would i act surprised this is one of you aren't my best he's right he's right you're right I think it's him. The more and more I look at this nigga, he has a straight face. All right. He has a straight face. <laughs> so the mole has one. And on the count of three, I'm going to have the mole step forward. One. 
Two. Why you look at him like that? Three. <laughs> None of them are gay. What? None of them are gay. Yeah. We're, what? We're all the most. Let's, 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 let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I think there was Damn. a mix up, you guys. I, Look at us. We are besties after all. I was very We're confused. Oh, I was yeah. like, you had me with the fit, Ricky. Where everyone Bro, is yeah. a mole. Dude, dude, this is my girlfriend's tea. So nobody was gay? Bro, they what are the all fuck? straight. <laughs> what the fuck? They're all straight. I, what the fuck? How are like, come on, that's not even a normal twist. How, how are we supposed to get that right? Like, actually, I guess technically we were right. They are all straight. But also, we were very wrong. That actually, like, made this whole video, like, I got me tight. Now nah, I feel like I got it wrong. So that's, I guess, like, how that, straight wait, people think. I, I'm gonna say, is that literally just nothing but a bunch of straight men trying to act gay? <laughs> <laughs> No. That's insane. That's insane. Actually, I think I've seen. Uh, I seen. I don't know if it was a TikTok or on YouTube or what, but I remember seeing this one. I'll say a clip, but I don't think it was a clip. It was probably a video on one of them platforms, whatever, of a dude where he was like, "We should have a show where we get six people to pretend to act gay, and we gotta find. We gotta eliminate the people who aren't gay, so then we gotta." for like a month or three months straight we're watching uh not gay men trying to find out who's gay uh I, I, that's what popped in my head as soon as i seen uh, this i love how these niggas made up a fucking fan fiction for themselves <laughs> <laughs> how they came out the closet and then challenged each other like wait a minute you said and this nigga's also straight thinking this like hmm that don't sound pretty gay of you to say that answer. <laughs> to challenge you on this. This is sick fucking video, Jubilee. <laughs> You're nasty for doing this. Somebody told me there was a twist at the end. I feel like when I go out with my friends, I get hit on by more guys than girls sometimes. And yeah. it's um, it's very common, yeah. I got uh, mistaken for being gay a lot of the time. I even, I'll be honest, I went on dates with guys because so many people were suspecting me of it. But I was just like... That's not me. After being on those dates, I was like, I like women. That's a, that's a fact. My story. That's a fact. Um, <laughs> are you are you gonna come out today? <laughs> like, like, you just like just do it, man. Oh, I'm trying not to troll, bro. But yo, fucking hell, dude. I've been training for this shit for a week. Told you, he was trying way too hard. He was trying way too hard. Bro. He's been training. He's been training. <laughs> Not but is that not crazy? I mean, imagine if a white nigga said, "I've been trained to be black for a week," and was saying some of the most degenerate shit imaginable, bro. Who's your favorite basketball player? LeBron. Easy nigga. You should ask favorite me type of. See why? See that? That's what I'm saying. Why are these niggas getting canceled, bro? Why are they not getting canceled? Because if a white man was like favorite fruit, watermelon, duh. How did you train for it? Bro, I on all my gay homies. They were saying, like, I'm going to be a verse top because that's, like, the least sus, but it's also gay. Dude, I practice walking. I, practice I didn't know what fit. a I was doing, like, 360 Snapchat videos. Like, damn, do I look gay or not? Like, does my ass pop? I work what in Urban the Outfitters. Fuck? There's a lot yeah. of gay men. He helped me pick up this nail polish. I oh. called all my gay friends, and I watched, like, a whole bunch of drag. I watched so much drag, bro. Like, and it's actually really good. So I would probably keep watching, like, after this. <laughs> I think my game plan was to Bruh. just uh, not offend anybody. I hope I yeah, hope I stuck to that. I was no, <laughs> no, you didn't. All y'all niggas offended everybody, bro. Come on. Come I, on. Even, I don't think people were really that offended by this. I don't think so either. So I can say whatever I want to say if you want to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these niggas was not gay enough. Not for me. Not for me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not for in me. terms of no, listen, listen. I'm talking about in yeah. terms of is, watching the video. This is adding on to my theory. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm talking about in terms of adding watching the video. If you're gay, that's what I'm saying. If if I was acting gay, I would dress up like Saucy Santana. Hey, this video's done. <laughs> no, we gotta talk. <laughs> we gotta talk. Make this video if you guys have no, watched wait. it already. Drop a like this on this video. The bottom. No, what is done. a phrase? Hey man. What is a phrase? Hey man. What? The two guys handshake was so funny, both accusing each other of being straight. No way Jubilee convinced a bunch of straight dudes to act gay. No convincing, they did a casting, took applications from whirling participants, then boom. And made sure no one won. MFAO. As a gay person, I know they wasn't gay. 
it was a fun video, but not something to get offended by. I didn't think it was very offensive either, but I'm not gay, so I wouldn't know. But yeah, like, subscribe. See you guys later. Hope you have a good day or night, and bye.